did I qualify for stage two of the COD Mobile World Championship 2020? Well, you'll find out. Hello, my beautiful enjoyments of the internet. It's me, Tag Fee, and today we're gonna take a look at if I, you know, I, I joined the, the COD Mobile Tournament. It's the World Championship. So I joined it, and, and, and I'm gonna tell you whether I qualified or not. Stay tuned. And watch out because it's gonna be a bumpy ride full of mayhem, romantic, love, uh, disparity, uh, 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 cosplayers, um, uh, sadness, and I don't know. But we're gonna have fun together. So let's just jump right in. At this point in the tournament, I had three wins and three losses, but that didn't stop me from achieving my dreams and getting qualified. As you can see, I am a pro ranked player, so I have the home field advantage of 40% more points than the average veteran. <laughs> Here we are, at the beginning of the match, prepping up for what should be the most epic encounter of gaming history. As the countdown went zero, I dashed towards the enemy. I did not know where the enemy was, but we were just going with it. I dashed towards the enemy, and then I scanned everywhere, looking for it. Lo and behold, I went to the back, and they were right, nope, they weren't there. Uh, there was right there. I got, I got shit at all. But that didn't stop me from wanting to go on a murderous rampage. As you saw there, I just killed a noob with, uh, with my M4 magma and I died. But it still didn't stop me. You know why? Because I am a legend. I'm a legend and I will qualify for this. What I did, I just hid in here. I slid to the DMs and I killed every single Warframe in my path. That sweet double kill. And then I saw this idiot walking here and he proceeded to kill me. God damn it. At this point in time, we're at the halfway moment of the match. I just got my grenade launcher. And when someone decided to fit me, I bombed both of us. I was a hero and I sacrificed myself. At this point in this match, which was the seventh match, by the way, or sixth, I don't know. Was this, I got grenade did. But I was determined that I, you know, you know, I mean, I'm tacky. I don't drop out from a fight. So I decided to kill that Goliath, and I proceeded to sacrifice myself with it. I then brought my AK-47 Blue Steel. This sexy beast and I decided I want to go murder that that thing I proceeded to kill anyone who was walking by and then he shot me I turned back I sat down and I was the final kill I was the final kill second match was hard point. I proceeded to throw my ball on this sexy beast of a man and it exploded in his face. And I was waiting for the match to start and I proceeded to turn into this fucking while he proceeded to shoot me. God I love that dude. As you can see by that sweet number 10 to 50 something that I've I and my team, we were just murdering them as we are beasts. As you can see by that sweet number, 10 to 50 something, that I've, I and my team, we were just murdering them. Why the fuck you lying? Why you always lying? Mm, oh my 
my god stop fucking lying in our own way i proceeded to, to infiltrate their base and i got killed but that didn't stop me you can't stop me because i am invincible and i am immobile so what i did next i threw a grenade I waited for them to come out so I could savor that kill moment. And and I just realized that we're the ones losing. <laughs> oh god. Ooh. <laughs> oh my god. We are the ones that are losing. Oh shit man. After knowing that we got raped, we got raped hard, ladies and gentlemen. We got raped super fucking hard. And, uh, uh, something ticked inside me that I'll never forget. I was about to unleash a beast. A beast, ladies and gentlemen, that has never been before seen in Call of Duty Mobile. <laughs> Here we are in the uh, I lost count of what mass this is but we're just gonna go with it. I proceeded to unleash the beast that I was meant to be called you. Since this was, you know, Nuketown, my home planet, I decided, you know what? Maybe I'll just murder these fools and see what happens. I, I, as you just saw, I killed someone. And then I killed that dude because he's an idiot. And then I infiltrated their spawn location. I did not camp. I am not one to camp. I just went behind that fool and shot him straight in the butt. Anyway, we're moving around the point here. I was using some sweet tactics. I like sliding and jumping. And look at that. Look at that! I shot that fool in his window! I proceeded to do more tricks. More tricks to, you know, kill all of them in one sitting. And it worked! It worked, ladies and gentlemen! I have never unleashed this side of me before. And I'm afraid this is just the beginning of my qualification. So I, I, I took those two steel bearings and I clenched it up there, assholes. I killed another dude. Life was going so well as we are reaching the final lengths of this round. They burned me, those sick bastards. They burned me and obviously we're the ones that are going to win because you know, we're just sexy beasts and I proceeded to shoot the hell out of everything. There, there might be a chance that they're coming back. I just realized that. But not to worry, because I, I will help. But I brought this team to victory. As you saw, I, I did the last kill cam. This was a proud moment in my life. I would like to thank my dog, my pet monkey Dave, and his sister Jackie. Look at that! Oh, that is a thing oh my God! Oh, oh my fucking God! This is it, ladies and gentlemen. This is the final round. Before we find out if I am qualified or not in the week one stages of the qualifiers. I believe in myself. And we're in for a wild ride in this domination. As you saw it, my sexy beast of a team, we are dominating them. 73 and 20 something. I cannot see properly, but look at that, 75 and 20, we're on a roll guys, we're so on a roll that I might be able to win the whole damn thing, no I'm just kidding, cause, cause I've never been in a tournament before, but this time I feel confident and I feel like I'm gonna whack all of their asses, cause they're naughty boys, and they're trying to take all our spots. So what do I do then? I try to take their spot because I am also a naughty boy. And this dude is he killed me. He killed me and I never forgave him. My team and I 
were on the brink of victory. As I just double killed those two wankers. That's right people, we call them wankers on the tag fee show. We call them freaking wankers. Then I proceeded to slide with so much drift, bruh. And I proceeded to take their base as they planned to take our base too. Which was not gonna happen by the way, because of the sole fact that they took our base already. But I wasn't about to give up. I gravity spiked their asses and I proceeded to take back what's mine. Look at that, look at that guy. But we are just a few points away from victory. There was no chance for this team as they are completely destroyed by my team because we are the sexy beasts of the Call of Duty mobile culture. As you saw, we won. We won. And look at this sick final kill cap. Even though it wasn't by me, this guy we got a sick final kill cap. Look at that beauty. Look at that beauty. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. He didn't even know it was coming. What a dick. Ladies and gentlemen, now the moment you've all been waiting for. Did I qualify? The moment of truth, ladies and gentlemen. The moment of truth. Come on. Get, get in there. Get in there. Yeah. 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 Oh, what? 70 points. Set. Set. I almost qualified at this point. I almost got the gold at this point but since I lost three matches in a row that that stopped me from qualifying the first week I was devastated and I cried like a baby as you saw that was pretty goddamn sad and it makes me sad too. But I was not about to give up as then I found out that next week there's gonna be a second round. It, a second chance for me. And I was not about to let it slip out of my fingers. Stay tuned for next week to find out if I qualified or did I just sink in the shit shitters again. Thank you for watching.